Yo, what is going on guys? We are back with another brand new diorama. Uh, the diorama that I have for you guys today is an alleyway diorama. Uh, I don't think I've done an alley diorama. I think I did maybe one or two dials a while back, like way back when I started making dials. And, but this one's, this one's different. Uh, the format, the way I went about doing this one, uh, this is more for for ACBA artists, uh, toy photographers, people that actually do displays. Um, the way I did the pieces, the way I, I brought I brought it together, I get I'm kind of giving more possibilities on this dial. The the angles that people can actually shoot, like something like this, uh, like this, and I did make the. That roll up door removable so you're gonna be able to remove that door and if you have a if, and if you already have another dial you can remove the door put another another dial on the back and it's gonna be it'll look it'll, it'll look great just the depth that you're gonna be able to get with this dial is, is it's really good and also right here I'm gonna go ahead and make this this is removable so I could pop this open and you can remove it. Either this could be a vent. And I'm also gonna add um, some, um, like a little piece of plastic to make it seem like a window. So you're gonna be able to put that as a window. And right here, the same, let me move this ghost right out of the way. Um, the same thing right here. If you have another dial or another wall or whatever, you could attach it to that side of the, of the, um, of the wall and just shoot like this, and you're gonna be able to get a, a lot of depth on this dial. You're gonna be able to shoot this way. Like this. So yeah, just the, the way you're gonna be able to shoot with this one is, is gonna be really good. And on this door right here, I'm still thinking about it. Um, since this is not a commission, this was it was kind of kind of like just doing whatever I want with it. So, since it's not a commission, I'm trying to, I'm going to go ahead and, and maybe, I'm not really sure, maybe do a damaged roll-up door, maybe put a hole in this, not, not on this one, make another one with a hole, so you can have a little bit more, more options with it, and I think it'll, it'll give it some, a different touch, something new to bring, you know, you know, we do it. So anyways, yeah, this is the, the way this dial came out, nothing too special, just, regular brick um, foam there's a little close-up of everything i did just added a bunch of little trash since this, this is supposed to be a dirty alleyway i uh, did the grout on the um, on the brick and i i think i'm just gonna keep going with it i really like the way it looks uh when i do it when i don't do it uh it seems unfinished so i'm gonna keep going with the with the grout in the middle. And a lot of people ask, what do I use for the grout? For the grout, you can use basically anything. There is a mixture that I was using before. It was called uh, Cement Mixture for Miniatures. And I think you could still find that on eBay, but you could go to Home Depot and buy that um, that paste, that putty paste for, uh, for fixing holes and stuff. You could also use that. That's what I use on this one right here. I have this uh, um, that pipe right there. I think it's for what is it for? Um, for water, I think a water pipe or something. Who knows? And right here, I added a an electrical box with a few straws, a few connectors, and glued it using hot glue. Here's some more, a little bit of grass, some more trash. A little gate right here. Yeah, I use um, gutter mesh for the for the fence. I stole that idea from our figures. <laughs> and the yellow poles right there, they're from uh, those sponges from Michaels. Just remove the sponge, and that's what you can use for the for the poles. There you go. Here's a close-up on the floor. And 
like I said before, I think it's something simple, but something that's gonna give you a lot of possibilities when you shoot, when you're doing ACBA, uh, when you're doing toy photography, whatever you do, if you're doing um, any kind of toy picks, uh, this die is gonna come in handy. And on the stuff that I said that I was gonna do, I'm gonna go ahead and post those pictures on Instagram, so. I won't be able to put them in this video unless I do it before I put this on YouTube. Then I'll go ahead and show them at the end of the video. So I'll do that. And if you guys don't follow me on Instagram, make sure you guys do. I also have a Facebook page. Um, I'll go ahead and link all that in the description below so you guys can check that out. All right. All right, guys. So I'm out of here. All right, um, like I said before, nothing but installation foam, poster foam, and... A little bit of balsa wood, but that's about it. All right, if I missed anything, I know this was kind of like a quick video just showing you guys what I did, but I think, but if you follow my videos, I've done this a million times and, well, not a million, a few times. And I already went over every, all the stuff that I do. All right, guys, so I'm out of here. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And if you have, uh, thank you very much. I appreciate it, and good looking out. I'm out. Thanks. Thank you.